Hello, I'm in a unique setting, and I have a unique drink to try. I saw this on a targeted Instagram ad, as happens these days, because these tech companies know everything about us. Anyway, um, and I knew I had to find it, and sure enough, at the shitty local grocery store, I found Arizona hard tea. Now, I'm a huge, you know, I grew up with Arizona cans. They were like my, you know, they're a big part of my life, I guess you'd so to say. It sounds kind of pathetic when they say it out loud, but it's true. Um, and the green tea variety was probably always my favorite. It fluctuated a little bit sometimes, but that was probably like the one I went back to the most. And this is a hard one. This could either be really good or absolutely vile and disgusting, but there was no way I could pass this up and not try it. So I'm going to do just that. It smells like liquor, <laughs> if that's any sign. It's only supposed to be 5%, but um, let's give it a go. Bottoms up. Okay, let's try this again. So starting out, it tastes like pretty identical to Arizona green tea. And it just sort of mellows out like this really nasty, like shitty, cheap alcohol taste at the end. It's pretty bad. Like you keep taking a sip, expecting the good Arizona green tea flavor to like continue and it just always like gets cut short by this gross taste. Um, I don't know if I could finish this, especially since it's like this big ass tall boy. Yeah, I'd say definitely skip this, this is pretty vile. Um, just like get an Arizona green tea and mix it with vodka or something, I don't know what to tell you.